guys, welcome to day three of Spooktober. Um, I completely forgot to post yesterday, I apologize on that. Um, but today, and for the third day of Spooktober, I'm going to be doing a horror movie slash Halloween movie collection. I have, I have quite a few because I love horror movies. Um, and I thought I would show you guys. Now here, I'll, let's go over to my shelf. So here are my shelves of horror movies and Halloween movies I have. I do have Hocus Pocus and Nightmare Before Christmas, but they are not on the shelf. Um, I have them on my Disney shelf. So let's get started. So we have the Addams Family and Addams Family Value 2-pack collection. The first season of the Addams Family. The second season of the Addams Family. I have Annabelle on Blu-ray. I have Annabelle Creation. I have Annabelle Comes Home. American Werewolf in London. I think this movie is really good. It's really funny. Really good werewolf scene in that. Really good transformation scene. Uh, Stephen King's Carrie. Child's Play from last 2019. Curse of La Llorona. And I apologize if I just punctured that. This movie was really good. I really enjoyed The Curse of Iorona. Crawl, another really good suspenseful movie. The Conjuring. The Conjuring 2. Doctor Sleep on DVD. Doctor Sleep on Blu ray. And then we have, I'm gonna go here, The Exorcist. Love the cover on that. Escape Room. And the whole entire series, all eight film collection of Friday the 13th. And I, there we go, there's no. And then we move on to this shelf. And then we have Friday the 13th remake. We have Fantasy Island. Grudge 2. The Grudge that just came out this year. Horns. This one I kind of didn't know where to put, so I just kind of put it in horror because it kind of then has some scary parts in it, if from what I remember. Happy Death Day. Happy Death Day to you. I have pretty much all of the Halloween movies except for a couple. I have the original Halloween movie on Blu ray and DVD. Halloween 3. The three film collection, which includes these Halloween H2, Halloween Resurrection, and Halloween The Curse of Michael Myers. And then the 2018 Halloween movie, which I thought this movie was really good. Then It. Then the 2017 version of It. It Chapter 2, Invisible Man, this movie was really good. I thoroughly enjoyed that one. Here we have the Insidious 3 film collection. I have Lost Boys, the 3 film collection. And Nightmare on Elm Street. So we move down to here. We have the four film collection of Nightmare on Elm Street, The Nun, Orphan, Pet Cemetery. I thought this movie was really good. And it's not wanting to go back in. Okay, there we go. Uh, Paranormal Activity. Paranormal Activity 3, yes, I know I'm missing a few. Purge and Purge of Anarchy. Poltergeist, one, two, three of Seasons of Pretty Little Liars, A Quiet Place, Ready or Not, this movie is really good, I really am going to keep saying it. it's really good, there were some I didn't like, but that one was really good, I thought, Form From Collection of Stephen King Movies, 
cat side was the only one I've watched so far. I have no comment on that one. It was okay. Not one of my favorites. Scary Stories to Tell in the Dark. I wanted to see that one in the theaters, but I never actually got a chance to. The Shining, a true horror classic. Stephen King's Four Film Collection, and yes, I've watched all of these. I think my favorite one out of them is either Pet Cemetery or Silver Bullet. And then I have MTV Scream, the first season. And then I have the first season of Stranger Things. And the second season of Stranger Things. I have Screams 1, 2, and 3. I have Scream 4. Us. Two copies of The Woman in Black. Because there's actually a long story with that one. Um, the Woman in Black 2, Angel of Death. And the last one I have here on my collection is Winchester. I hope you guys enjoyed day 3 of October. And I'll see you guys tomorrow in my next video.